Hello everyone, I welcome you all to my channel. In this video, we are going to see compiler, assembler, linker and loader. This is very very important topic in embedded and real time systems. First, let us see what is a compiler. So, compiler is a software which is used for converting a high level language into a low level language that means for converting from one language to another language we go for this compiler so the best example for high level language is our C language so C language is very simple and we can easily understand what are the process carried out then we should know what is a low level language so low level language is the assembly language that means for writing microprocessor coding center, we will be using mnemonics, operands, opcodes and etc. So these languages are called as assembly languages. But remember one thing, your computer will know only zeros and ones. That means it can understand only zeros and ones. So that language is called as machine language. So finally, we have to convert our high level language into our machine language. So these process is called as compilation, assembly and linking and loading. So using this process, we can convert a high level language into a machine language and we can load it into the IC. So for example, consider a Chinese man wants to program a robot. But he doesn't know how to program the robot. So he go to a programmer for programming it. So here comes the compiler. So it converts the high level language into the assembly language. Then comes the assembler. So this assembler will convert this assembly language into object code. Object code is nothing but the binary language only. That is bit file only. But it cannot be executed. So using a linker, we can convert this object code into a bit file. That means executed binary file. So then this file is loaded into the IC. And finally, this IC is fitted inside the robot for operation. So next we are going to see the overall process carried out here. So first one is high level language. So high level language means the best example is our C language. So this is a C program for uh, adding two numbers. So sum is equal to A plus B. So we can easily understand from the statements given. So what is the process carried out here? Now using a compiler, we are going to convert this high level language into an assembly language. So assembly language means it consists of instructions, that is mnemonics, then labels, etc. So after converting it into assembly language, the next process is using an assembler we will be converting it into object code so object code is nothing but a binary file so it is zeros and ones so the coding will be like this so these instructions are converted into zeros and ones but these codings cannot be executed so we have to convert this into an executable file so for this purpose we go for linker so this linker will combine the files present in the library with our object code and it will create an executable binary file. So now this file can be easily executed. So this file is again loaded into the IC using the loader. So this is the overall process carried out here. So first the high level language is converted into assembly language. Then this assembly language is converted into object code. Then object code is converted into executable bi fi binary file. Then finally it is loaded into the IC. I hope you all have understood what is compiler, assembler, linker and loader. If you like this video, kindly subscribe my channel. Also share with your friends. Thank you.